going on YouTube? This is Travis here with Central Trading Card Company, bringing you guys yet another amazing, high-quality YouTube video. Huge shout-out today to Trevor for letting us open up his uh, battle style stuff here on our YouTube channel. I want to thank him for that, so it allows us to uh, give you guys some more content because we are super short on battle styles, so we can't really we don't have too much to open up. So appreciate Trevor for letting us to open up your ETB in our booster box. So... Without further ado, we're going to start with our booster box, get this bad boy opened up, and let's take a look and see what we got in here today. So, what Battle Styles was officially released yesterday. Uh, we've already done three, a total of three booster box openings one for the channel, and then two for Arku. Uh, which, if you guys haven't seen it, go back, watch RQ's live video that we did for him. Uh, holy crap, man. The guy pulled the, um, was it the uh, Rapid Strike Urshifu uh, Alternative Art VMAX Secret Rare. So huge, huge stuff there, man. Pretty cool. Uh, oh, man, that Pokeball dust all over my fingers. But code card for the kids, guys. Enjoy. Green code card. Now, these code cards were really messed up yesterday, so we'll see... If they're still continuing that pass, yeah, look, so we have a green code card, but yet it's still a freaking hollow. So it looks like the code cards are still jacked up. So interesting, interesting, man. I'm telling you guys, uh, print runs and the quality control has been atrocious lately. So, um, oh, it's kind of interesting that these are so screwed up like that, man. But code card for the kids. Enjoy, guys. Let's do a quick little... Nope, doesn't look like it's going to be a hit. So I'll just take a quick little peek on the corner, see if there's anything that looks like it might be a hit. If there's a hit, then we'll do the card trick, guys. So that's kind of how we'll play this one, since we uh, can't go by the code card colors anymore. Which is kind of cool, man. Brings us back to the old days, right? The old days before <laughs> people were weighed packs and all kinds of crazy crap, man. But uh, no, nope, don't see anything here. All right, 0 for 3 so far, man. Ouch. Booster box not looking too good. Um, so far, I'm still averaging... Oh, see, this one's going to be a white coat card. We'll see if it's actually going to be white or not. Uh, so far, still averaging one gold card per booster box, which is kind of crazy. Yep, see, white coat card, and it is a non hollow uh, weird stuff going on with code cards, man. Not too sure. It must have just been this print run because it's all come. All of this is coming from the same distributor. So we have five distributors to order from. Uh, so this one came all from the same distributor. So it's probably a print run error. Um, but uh, it's a white code card, so we'll see if that's going to be another white one or not. But highly doubt it. We'll peek on the edge. Oh, yep, it is going to be. For once, it is actually correct. So let's go through this nice and slow. And we got the, um, for RQ, man, he pulled the Rainbow Rare for the uh, Mustard, which is a pretty cool looking card. You guys go back at the, or look at our YouTube channel and see that one. And it looks, I think this is a V card, so we'll take a look. Oh, Tapu Koko V. Okay. Not too bad, man. I'm glad to see Tapu, Tapu Koko back in a set again, so that's kind of nice. Been a little while since we've seen one of those. Mm -hmm. All right. He makes it on the pedestal. First card to make it on the pedestal for the night. Let's take a look, man. So we got 36 packs plus, what, another 8 from the ETB. So should be a pretty good night. Plenty of packs to go around. Let's just take a look real quick. Nope. It's going to be a hollow. Oh, Kingdra. That actually looks pretty cool. But I like the, I'll actually like the more Peko as well. That's pretty cool. All right. Keep on keeping on, guys. Code card for the kids. And, nope, don't see anything here. Uh, tons, what, six gold cards to pull. Uh, tons of rainbows to pull. Uh, lots and lots of hits for this set, man. It's going to be a very hard set to get the master on. going to be lots of opening just to get those masters. So it should be, should be kind of crazy. But I'm um, also looking forward to that Chilean Rain set, man. I saw some of those uh, Japanese arts already for 
uh, the Japanese versions, man, that's gonna look, that's gonna be awesome. Uh, it's gonna be one heck of a set. Got the uh, gold Snorlax most likely, which is gonna be pretty awesome. Man, that looks, that looks pretty cool. Meowstic, huh? Interesting. It actually looks pretty cool. Wow, this has been terrible though, man. Almost halfway through on the right side already. Not a single thing. Got one V card, no V maxes, no nothing really. I mean, this has just been atrocious. Oh, yep, and wow. that just means we're loaded in the back end, right? It has to be. I don't know. So far, to me personally, other than opening it for RQ, uh, Battle Style has been pretty rough, man. I've been getting terrible pulls out of ETBs. Um, so, not really sure what's going on with this stuff, man. The pull rates seem awfully rough, at least for me. But, like I said, I mean, uh,. RQ did pull the alternative art secret rare rapid strike Ishifu, or Shifu. So, I mean, I think I saw something here. No, maybe not. Jeez, man, this is this is rough. So we got six packs left for the right side, and all we have is a Tapu Koko V. Ooh. Yikes. Well, sorry, Trevor, man. This is not looking good for you, bud. Not looking good for you at all. No, jeez, man. All right. Well, hopefully that whole left side is loaded, man. Yeah, I mean, Pokemon's quality control, man, has... All right, there we go. Looks like we got a V card here. Possible V card, or V max, just to say. Possible V max, but I think it's a V card. Piplup, Mankey, and oh, is this gonna be a Mimikyu? Mimikyu, Mimikyu. Ah, uh, Necromza. All right. Well, still not too bad, but uh, I don't know what's going on with these, man. Don't want V's. We don't need V's. We get V's all the time. Don't need V's. Well, he'll still make it to the pedestal nonetheless. Because we've had complete trash getting pulled so far. Uh, again, sorry Trevor man. Looks like we used all of our luck on RQ for the day. Or for the week, I should say. Um, but dang man. Um, nope. Steelix and Luxio Reverse. Alright, after this pack, we still have two more for the right side, then that's it. We're completely finished with the whole right side of the booster box already, with complete trash. Nope, 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 nope. One left, one pack left after this. I did notice the packs are a lot easier to open up than they have been in the past with the recent prints and stuff, so kind of like that aspect of it. Um, yeah, no, see, it's me, white co card, but it's not gonna be anything. Uh, bop, 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 see, mm -hmm. terrible, terrible, terrible. All right, last pack for the right side, which has been complete garbage, complete and utter garbage. Oh, I see a V Max, though. I do see a V Max finally. Oh, hey, it's actually a white code, too. I'll be damned. All right, let's see. VMAX it is. Alright. My guess is... I hope I hope it's Victini, man. That's the one I really want. That's the VMAX I really, really like. Ooh, Yamper. Alright. I'm hoping for Victini or Mimikyu, too. Oh, okay. Corvid Knight. Actually, I'll take that. I'll take that. I actually love Corvid Knight, so... I forgot about the Corvid Knight, so... Pretty dang awesome. That's actually really super stoked for that one. Move you over here. We'll put Corvid Knight in the center. Love the artwork on the Corvid Knight. I think it looks sick. Uh, one of my favorite art styles so far. All right, let's go. Off to the left side. Can't be any worse than the right side. That's for damn sure, man. Cannot be any worse. Don't see anything. There you guys go. Code cards for the kids.
Coke cards for the kids. I'm telling you, you can't even trust any of these Coke cards anymore. This is complete garbage. What a garbage booster box. Oh, I do see something here, though. I do see something here. So, one thing I did notice is, uh, oh, my camera's glitching up. Uh, the white code cards, though, on, like, the VMAXs and stuff are still accurate, but when they, uh, oh, man, what's going on with my camera? But, uh, on the ones that are, like, just regular hollows and stuff, that's when they're all mixed, that's when they're all jacked up for whatever reason. Ooh, a nice little reverse Phoebe. Uh, it's going to be a regular V card, it looks like. And we're, we pulled... Oh, nice. Corviknight V to go with the Corviknight V Max. All right. Now, why is my camera all jacked up, man? Oh, looks like I had to get my camera replaced. I think it's the auto-focusing, for whatever reason, just been jacking this up lately. Because if we try to mess with the... Uh, I've been messing with my uh, hue and tint and everything, and I think it's been really been jacking this crap up. Uh, we'll see how long it lasts. Sorry, guys. Apologize. Put that back over there just a tad. All right. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Green code card. Could be a hollow, but it's not gonna be a V card. Yep, so you can be a hollow, but no V. So I noticed all the V V Max stuff. It seems like the uh, the co cards are correct, but uh, I don't know, man. Let's see. Well, no, I'll take that back because I think on our, our coups, man, we pulled his secret rare on a green co card. So yeah, not really too sure, I guess. Uh, uh, but I mean, I'm, this has been this is actually a pretty treacherous box. I'm sorry. This is. <laughs> By far the worst box I opened for Battle Style so far. For dang sure, man. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh, got ooh, got something. Ooh, 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 ooh. Was that an alternative art? Ooh, man. That could have been an alternative art there for you, Trevor. Come on, dude. Let's go. Let's get you something here, man. Electabuzz, and, oh no, it's Tepu Coco VMAX, though. All right, okay, okay. Got two VMAXs now. Move this guy back over here. The two Tepu Cocos are next to each other. Let's go ahead and move the two Corvid Knights next to each other. All right, nice little Lucky Buzz Reverse Hollow. All right, let's keep this ball rolling. Two V Maxes and then three V so far. I mean, that's not good. I'm not gonna lie. That is actually really quite bad. Ah man. Oh wow. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, no, no, no real big hit yet out of the box, so still waiting for that big hit. Maybe some kind of secret rare, a gold card, something. Should be seeing something coming up, man. Should be seeing something coming up. This is complete and utter garbage. What? Got like eight packs left, maybe? So, ooh. Ugh. Oh boy. Alright, still waiting for that big hit. Okay. This pack's not opening, so maybe this is the big hit pack. Need that big hit pack, man. Not gonna be not gonna be it. Uh, boy, oh boy, oh boy. 
boy, this has been a bad, bad box. Five, only five packs after this dude. This is, this is sad, Trevor. No, I'm sorry, man. This is just, this is pathetic, dude. I'm not too happy with battle styles, man. This crap is pretty, pretty dang bad. I'm not sure why these booster boxes are this freaking bad, man. Oh, okay, we got a V card. Looks like. <sighs> got a V card. Not a, no hits though, man. No real big hits, which is really sad. Not sure what's going on, man. Pretty disappointing. And okay, full art single strike Urshifu B, man. Okay, okay. Still nothing, uh, nothing super crazy, man. I mean, you kind of expect some full arts and stuff, so. Still pretty disappointed unless we get the uh, get something on these last four. Right. Total of four packs left. Three after this one, man. Still real no big chase card out of the booster box yet, man. Oh, Victini missed that one by accident, but all right, another another V card. Not what we really need, but all right, we'll add another Victini to the list. Alright, two packs left after this. Two B Maxes. Got one full art. And what? Five, uh. Five V cards, man. But. Not a single. Uh, gold card or ultra rare. No rainbow rares. Hmm, a little disappointed. All right, well, last pack magic, perhaps. Not holding my breath the way this box has been going. I guess we still have ETB. I forgot about that, too. So maybe we'll get lucky in ETB. But definitely, definitely not holding my breath, man. Green co card. Not holding my breath for anything because this is trash. What a trash, trash box. All right, well, let's do a quick little recap, man. So, one, two, three, four V cards. Uh, one full art. The single strike Urshifu V, which is that's a nice hit. I mean, I'm not going to lie. That's, that's a solid, solid hit. Um, and then we got the Corviknight V Max, my favorite art uh, out of the set. And then Tapu Koku V Max. Very nice. So that's what we got. Not a whole lot. Let's see if the booster box uh, is any better. Not booster box, but see if this ETB is any better. Uh, what did I do with it? There it is. Opened the blue one so far, haven't opened the red, so kind of might just take a quick little peek here inside the red one. I like the blue dice a lot better. Uh, take a look at the sleeves, that's pretty cool. All right, typical, typical stuff. packs for complete garbage <laughs> now let's see if these so every time I open up the booster or the ETBs the co-cords have been correct so 
Uh, let's take a look, I guess. This one feels thick, so it's probably gonna be a green code. Let's see if it is true. Yep, all right, so that is correct. So I think the ETBs should follow suit with the correct code cards. I just think that, I think the booster boxes uh, got all jacked up on some kind of print run somewhere along the lines because this should be no hollow again, which it is correct. Oh man, it's, uh, not not really liking the set honestly. I'm not gonna lie, just a lot of a lot of crappy pulls, man. At least with like. Uh, Vivid voltage and stuff, even green codes, uh, you know, like, you know, causing eclipse and stuff like that. You still have a chance to pull decent stuff out of green codes as well. And, oh gosh, artillery, trash. All right, and camera's all jacked up again. Ooh, a white code card though. Boom. It's going to be Urshifu Single Strike, isn't it? Or Rapid Strike. All right. I feel like I've been pulling this left and right, too. But all right. Nothing too excited. Trevor, man, I mean, hopefully you're getting... Hopefully, you're getting, I guess you need some of this stuff, I hope, man. But uh, it's been pretty lackluster. I'm not going to lie. Oh, boy. I see a Rainbow Rare. Ho, ho, ho. There we go. And, of course, the camera's all jacked up right now. It has something to do with the um, the video settings, so I'll have to go back and adjust those later, man. It's kind of annoying. But there is a uh, Rainbow Rare in here, finally. Pull it out of the ETB, at least, man. So let's take a look, see what that Rainbow Rare is going to be, man. I hope it's a Victini. That thing's pretty dang cool. Yamper. Uh, oh, dude, actually, that's awesome. Phoebe. Rainbow Secret secret Rainbow Rare, man. That's actually a solid hit. There we go, man. Very nice. Very, very nice. Alright, we'll move Corviknight over just a tad. So we put Phoebe in the middle. But there we go, and of course my camera is all jacked up, but whatever. All right, three packs left, man. I mean, well, you got something. Finally, we got something, so. This other stuff's kind of whatever at this point. I don't expect too much more coming out of here, but you never know. So it looks like all the ETBs, all the code cards are correct. It's just the booster boxes that are all jacked up for whatever reason. All right. Well, that's going to do it, man. Uh, out of the ETB, at least we got that Phoebe Fuller Rainbow Rare Trainer. Nice little secret rare there, dude. Corner's a little beat up though. Centering's pretty rough, but nonetheless, man, still got that rainbow rare. Very cool looking. I like it a lot. Congratulations, man. Get these all packed up for you, sent off. So, but uh, as always, guys, like, subscribe. Make sure you guys follow us on the Facebook group. Got a cool, awesome little community over there. Uh, it's monitored by us from Central Trading. So, try to make a nice, safe community for everybody to trade and. Buy and sell over there. We got plenty of uh, daily ripping and ships as well. Uh, make sure you follow us on Twitch too as well. We go live every Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. So uh, take a look. Follow us there, guys. But uh, as always, thanks for stopping by, taking a look. And we'll see you guys next time.